Let's jump straight into the unboxing of the brand new Simply Good and Beautiful Math 4. Hi there, I'm Elaine from On the Same Page Together. On this channel, we talk about all things family. I am the kiddo who will be using this curriculum, and I'm excited to jump into it. I am currently finishing up the discontinued Math Level 3, and we will link it down below if you're interested. Alright kiddo, what do you want to look at first? This one. Mental Math Map Mysteries? Alright, let's get these other ones out of the way. Comment down below if you have any questions. I try to respond quickly and love being a part of your homeschool journey. Are you excited about these little stickers? Mm-hmm. Oh, look, this one has two stickers to do. Yep, because that's the end. There are no mental math lesson boxes for lessons 119 and 120 as they are assessments. Oh, and then here's the story. Don't look too closely. Just flip through. Oh, and, and a you, you choose. choose. And you go to A or B, and then you get a different you choose. Oh, are you excited for a choose your own adventure? Mm hmm There's the end for one and the end for another one. Oh, so the endings are different. Potentially. Mm -hmm. Three the endings. End. There's got to be another Four the endings. End. And there's the map where you'll put all the stickers. This is definitely a nice little glossy sticker mm -hmm. feel. And they are perforated there. So the way this book works, when the child is told to go to the mental math map mysteries in the lesson, you will open it to the right lesson and then you will hold the book up for the child and have them see the questions while you look at the answers. And when you complete all of the lessons on the page, they get to place the sticker on the map. Since this book really is just the answer key, I'm just going to quickly show you what that looks like and move on and we'll get into the course book. All right, kiddo, let's check out this book. There's this sticker on both the course book and the answer key. It says, this type of book binding works best when broken in. And then there's a QR code. Learn how at the goodandthebeautiful.com slash book binding. Unit 1 Overview. So there are new concepts taught, parent-teacher tips, concepts reviewed and expanded upon, and then extra supplies needed is simply a ruler and colored pencils or crayons. Look at this, Mom. African art. It looks like it's a color by number based on these words and the numbers on the line. Yep, the instructions tell you complete the math problems to discover the colors you need to complete the picture. You can color in all the small spaces without numbers in any color you'd like. This paper is a printer paper and it's the same as in the mental math book. Okay, unit assessment. So just like level two, the unit assessment covers two lessons, lesson 29 and 30. You read all of this to the child, and for lesson 29, the child will complete all of the exercises with purple headers only. Then the parent or teacher will correct the work. If one or more mistakes are made in the section, the parent or teacher will check the orange additional practice checkbox. For lesson 30, complete all of the orange sections that are checked. If you still miss multiple problems, go back and rewatch the video or reread the mini lesson for the topic. All the principles will be reviewed again in future units. If you have only a few or no orange sections, 
practice to practice, you may move on to the next unit. If you need additional practice, the purple part will tell you what lesson or lessons it's from. The Good and the Beautiful is offering free PDFs for levels 1 through 5 in this new curriculum. If you are interested in seeing what a printed PDF version looks like, my friend Anna over at Anna's Family Life on YouTube has a video that I will link down below in the description box. These groups of groups of groups of groups are cool. Mm -hmm. All done in a review. Nice. Oh, look, Mommy. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. Hmm, that's interesting. Parentheses, exponents, multiply, divide, add, and subtract. Yeah. That's so different than the other course. It is. This page is intentionally left blank so the child can remove the page to use for this lesson. This says my survey. Choose a question and write it here. Choose four possible answers and list them here. Leave room to make tally marks under each answer. Choose a population and a sample and write them here. As we get into Unit 3, if you found this page by page flip through to be helpful, please give us a thumbs up down below. Liking and commenting on our videos helps us reach other families who are looking for this information. This elephant you're supposed to color according to these. Oh, that's way cool. You color the different shapes. Like it says, color the triangles blue. Little lost sheep divided from the flock. Look, mommy, create your own lesson practice. Cool. If you're curious about what the discontinued math level 4 curriculum looks like, we will be uploading that flip through next, so subscribe and hit that notification bell to not miss it. Let us know down in the comments, are you planning to use Simply Good and Beautiful Math this year? If so, which levels are you looking at? Look at these mountains! Different mountains from different places. Wren Birdhouse Blueprints. That looks like it'd be fun to make. I like building. Look, there are Legos. Ooh, that's cool. Mega Monkey Math Path. That looks fun.
quite a few Italy's in this section. So what it's doing is a review game to review the whole course. You have units one and two going on with the same story, units three and four. That's cool. Then this is the course assessment. Mm -hmm. After that fun review, you get to do the assessment. Look, they don't have the words anymore. Mm. It's just Aunt Sally. Reference guide and the multiplication mastery chart. And no appendix in this book either. I just love that about Simply Good and Beautiful Math. It's all right there on the page. Each lesson has two prompts at the beginning, the Mental Math Map Mysteries activity book as well as the video lesson. This section below is used during the video and you can either use the QR code or you can go to the website and do it. We're going to use the computer for it so let's hop over there and show you how that works. We're simply going to type in goodandbeautiful.com forward slash math four and it will safely take us right where we need to go. Here's all of the units listed up above and within the unit you have every lesson in the course book with the applicable video or with no video noted. In the frequently asked questions you can see how to download the videos. If you want to see clips from the video lessons we will link the Good and the Beautiful's video down below. If you are interested in checking out all the curriculum we have from the Good and the Beautiful, here's a playlist of that. If you would like the playlist of just the math curriculum from the Good and the Beautiful, it's right here. When we release the discontinued math level for flip through, it will be right here. And here's a video that YouTube thinks you'll like. Just click on one of these and I'll see you over there.